it's Maddie, and today I'm super excited because I got hashtag Snapstar, and thank you so much to Yulu for sending me the hashtag Snapstar dolls. So let's see who Yulu sent us. I've been wanting these dolls for so long because they all look so cute. There we go. The struggle is real. So we have a little poster that says the Snapstar Squad and then it gives a little bit about all of them. We have Dawn, Echo, Aspen, Lola, Yuki, and Izzy. I think Izzy looks super cute. Oh my gosh, they're all so unique. And I have a challenge for you guys. Leave me a comment down below, who do you think you look the most like? Leave hashtag Snapstar and their name. So for me, I think I look the most like Aspen because she has blonde hair like me, except her hair is way longer than mine because mine only goes to like right here, so kind of my shoulders. But that's as close as I can get. And they each have a description on them. So while I read the description, I want you guys to think about who has the same personality as you. So listen closely to that and then leave me a comment down below also on who you think has the same personality as you, or at least close. And it's fine if you think you look the most like Aspen, but your personality is more like Izzy. Or you could have the same personality as Izzy and also look like Izzy, because we're all unique. Okay, let me tell you first about Dawn. Dawn is a fashion diva. Dawn is a high-powered, high-fashion diva who only settles for the best. She knows what she wants and always gets it. When Dawn isn't playing dress up, she is rubbing elbows with celebs and the most exclusive events. Want to know where the party is? Calm down. Echo is a bedazzled babe. Echo is a dreamy damsel who floats through life with an easy breezy outlook. Although she embodies the shimmering grace of a mermaid, she is never a fish out of water. Echo is a hair and makeup pro whose beauty tutorials have made her a social media superstar. No wonder all the girls like getting ready at Echo's place. Aspen is a hashtag wanderlust. Aspen is a wide-eyed wanderer. She is always on the go and doesn't mind living out of her suitcase. Aspen wants to see the world and she wants her followers to come along for the ride. Aspen also loves decorating her place and collect treasures from all over the world to adorn her abode. When it comes to interior decor, all the girls rely on Aspen's expert eye. Lola, 99% unicorn. Lola is a ball of positive energy who sees the best in everyone and the beauty in everything. Although Lola is a passionate and changing the world for the better, she believes kindness is the key. She's always bubbly and giggly. All the girls love having her around because she makes everyone around her feel great and wants to be their best selves. Yuki, hashtag turn up. Yuki is a feisty chick who marches to her own beat. She's a music enthusiast, always cranking out the hottest EDM tracks. When Yuki isn't in the studio, she is booked solid DJing parties all over the town. And she's always sure to get her girls on the VIP list. Izzy. Master Crafter. Izzy is a green girl who loves the environment and is passionate about recycling. This girl doesn't let anything go to waste. She can turn just about anything into something amazing. She loves hosting, crafting parties, and the girls go gaga over her creations. So for me, for personality wise, I think I am most like Lola. So um, let me know if you guys agree with me that I'm most like Lola and if you think I look like Aspen. I mean, it's okay if you don't think the hair looks like Aspen, but that's okay. And then remember, hashtag Snapstar, the girl who looks the most like you and the girl who has a pretty similar personality to you. Because Lola's not the exact same as me, but it's the closest that I could get. Okay, well there's another card here. Let's see what it says. I'll put this one down. So this one says the hashtag Snapstar Studio. So it says you can download the app to customize your hashtag Snapstar Studio. You can download it on the Apple App Store and or you could get it on Google Play. And here's the coolest thing. They come with a green screen so you can change the background. So you snap, style, and then you can share it. And look at all the different places you can share. There's Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Snapchat, Twitter, 
and TikTok. Okay, let's see who Yulu sent us. I'm so excited. All right, the first doll we have is We have Aspen. So this is the one that looks the most like me. So here's Aspen. I love her outfit, it's so cute. It's kind of like a little jumper. The second doll we have is Echo. And the final doll we have is Izzy. Oh, and I didn't know. They come with extra outfits. So each of them came with an extra outfit. So here's Aspen's extra outfit. I love this one. It totally matches her style. And then um, Echo's extra outfit is. Oh, it's like a mermaid. Like this is so shiny. It's like mermaid. And then Izzy's is. And then Izzy has this really cute blue jumper. I can't believe it actually came with these extra outfits. That's amazing. And thank you so much to Yulu again for sending us three of the Possum Hashtag Snapstar dolls. And my mom also went to Walmart and got me the other three dolls since there's six in the collection. And she also found three of the other um, like outfits and accessories. So that means I have the full hashtag Snapstar collection to show you guys today. So here's the three other dolls. I got Dawn, and I love her outfit. It's super cute. We have Yuki, and I was actually thinking on maybe choosing her personality because she was also kind of similar. And this is actually my favorite doll of all because she looks so cute. It's Lola. And now I'm gonna show you the other accessories. So we got this super cute white dress and I really like this. It's a dwarfs. This one actually kind of matches the blue outfit that Echo came with because it's just a pink version. And then we have this blue jean crop top with matching pants. And I love the pants because they have cute little ruffles at the bottom. So now we have different outfits for all the dolls to try on. I think this might be my fave. All right, well let's open up the dolls and the outfits and try out the green screen. So here's Izzy and they all come with a special accessory. Hers are purple hoop earrings. And then they all come with a purse and phone and hers are purple. And I love her sweater, it's so fluffy. And they're also pretty poseable. So she can bend her hand her knees are poseable. I don't know if her feet can move. So actually, if we take off her shoe, her foot is actually bendable too. So I guess you can take her shoes off and then they are still poseable. And it's perfect because you can take a whole bunch of different pictures with them in the Snapstar app. That one would kind of be perfect if she was maybe at the beach, chilling in the water, maybe playing in the sand. And the coolest part is that their hair will actually come off. And there's a few different reasons why their hair comes off. It's so for the app that you can actually change their hairstyle into a whole bunch of different ones that they don't have. You can also change them with the other dolls. So Izzy could have blonde hair, kind of con candy hair, black hair, blue hair. So there's a whole bunch of different styles that you can do. Or for the photos, you can just leave the hair on. Isn't that amazing? So each doll comes with a green screen stand. And why it's green is because when you go into the app and you add a background, it's so that this will disappear so it looks like they're actually on a ground or in a set. And they have a little hole in the back that clips in the green screen stand. And then it's actually posable here so it's like you can have them in different poses and you kind of want it to be a little bit higher so their feet are off the ground. They also come with a green screen backdrop. And the magic of the green screen is anything that's green will fade away and will allow you to put in any backdrop that you'd like. So your doll, it won't even look like they're on the stand. It could look like they're on a sandy beach. Isn't that cool? And the single most important point of green screen is you need the backdrop to be lit up, but not only the backdrop, but you need your doll to be lit up. 
because that creates shadow if it's not lit up. And the green will reflect back onto the doll and it won't make the green screen work as well. And she actually has her feet off of the ground because you don't want any shadow. And if her feet are touching the green screen stand, then that creates more shadow. And you want no shadow using a green screen, otherwise it won't work. And I'll show you how cool we can make that work in the app in a minute. But first, I gotta show you the rest of the five dolls we have. And here's Sweet Aspen, and her special accessory is her flower headband. And then her phone and purse are both pink. I actually am a big fan of her purse and phone. It's a beautiful shade of pink. And my favorite part of her outfit is probably her main jumper because it looks so cute with the flowers. That's Aspen. Here's Dawn, and her special accessory are some cutie earrings. Her purse and phone are both black, and my favorite part about her outfit are her heels. I just love how they're lace-ups. They look super cute with her outfit. There's Dawn. Here's my personality twin, Lola, and her special accessory is her leg warmers, and I love them. They're just so cute. And then her accessories are white. And my favorite part about her is her outfit is just so cotton candy. Like her hair looks like cotton candy, her top, and her leg warmers. Check out her cutie unicorn purse. Well, I mean, that's why she did say she was 99% unicorn. And there's my fave Lola. Oh my gosh, I love Yuki's headband. Look at the cute little stars. And whoa, look at Yuki's fishnet knee highs. And my fave part about her is her shoes. Look at like the chains on them. She's kind of rock star chic. And there's Yuki. Oh my gosh, that's some neon pink. I love it. Look at how pretty it is. And we have finally Echo. Although I love her hair. Look, she almost has like these little shimmery streamers in it. And then her boots are so fluffy and soft. I think she's probably one of my favorites for outfits because look at it. It's amazing. It's so soft and cozy. She's so lucky. So there's all six of our girls. Now let's check out the app so we can turn them into hashtag snap stars. So first up we have Aspen and I have a light on this side, a light on top and then I have another light on this side. So there's no shadow on her. And one thing for the app is that you would like it so all of your stuff is cleaned out because then it could chug the game and the game will crash on you. So you wanna make sure that you don't have a lot of games opened, otherwise the app won't work and it'll probably keep crashing. So that's a good practice when you're going onto a big app like Snapstar where you're gonna be taking pictures and doing lots of big things that you close down all of the other apps that you've been using. All right, so now we're gonna go into Snapstar. And one thing that you gotta make sure you do is I'm just going to go into the store here. So it actually shows a whole bunch of different girls and it says that you need to pick the girl that you're using. So it's like, you can't be using Aspen, but using like half Echo. So you need to make sure that the doll you're using is the doll that you're gonna take a picture of. Cause then it won't have their accessories. All right. Now what we're gonna do, if you guys can see this down here, I'm gonna click on this little green part to change the background. And now I can pick any background that I like. And, um, by her pose, I'm gonna pick like she's somewhere. And sorry, this is gonna be taking a little longer because um, I'm doing a screen capture for you guys here. And then you can see there's a star slider and um, this helps us because if we go all the way up on the star slider, it disappears, our doll. And then we kind of need to balance it to where we don't see a lot of green, but we still see her. So you can see I still have the doll's hair on, so I'm going to show you what it looks like with the hair on and then one without the hair. And it's good if you try and not have like lots of background on the top and or the bottom. I mean, sometimes it doesn't always show on the bottom. For this filter I'm doing, it doesn't. Um, but when you take a picture, there is an eraser, so you can erase the background, which I'll show you. So you get a little bit of top there there we go because I really wanted to try that cherry makeup style it looks so pretty there we go so that actually looks really pretty oh, oh. so this makeup styles look really pretty on her 
and I don't know if I want to do them because then I can't show you guys how to do lips and eyes so I think I'll skip out on that one and then there's actually these locked ones so if I click on this I can unlock it for 10 stars so I'm gonna unlock this one for 10 stars because it's sparkly so now she's gonna have some sparkly pink lips do you guys see that look how it's changing between and then we'll do her eyes uh, I kind of like this one it's kind of like a cat eye and then I actually did a uh, purple and it's kind of hard to see on her because her hair is kind of blocking in the way and then there's a whole bunch of different blushes Ooh, I'm gonna buy this one because it has like sparkles on it well not sparkles but these cute little hearts all right now for her eyelashes I'm going to do lots of small eyelashes and then you can pick the color I'm gonna kind of do these light gray ones Ooh, and now the eyeshadow. I think I'm gonna have it match her lipstick. Oh, yeah, so this is sparkly. At first, um, there we go. Uh, I like this pink, so she has lots of pink. And then these are the hairstyles, except <laughs> with the hairstyles, we can't really do it because she already has hair on. So I'll show you guys how to do that when I... I'm going to be doing her with no hair. And then I can add on some glasses, except I don't really want to cover her makeup. So I'll show you the glasses on one of the other characters possibly. And that is how you do their makeup. And now I click this button at the top, which is saving it. So then I go into the next little option. So this actually allows me, not collages, but these little filters, so the rainbows and the trees, this will allow me so that I can add on to her. I think I'm gonna do some sparkles because it's kind of covering her. That's okay, it'll still look cute. So there's Aspen and now I've actually saved it. So right here in the projects, I have her with no sparkles and then I have her with sparkles. So um, this is where they save to. Um, so that allows you so you don't need to take screenshots or pictures. And that's Aspen. Okay, now I'm gonna do Aspen with no hair. So change your position up. So here we have Aspen, and now I'm gonna do a different background. I don't know what I'm going to do. And I think this time I'm gonna do a full makeup. Whoa, dramatic. That does not look like Aspen. I really like this pink one. Ooh, that one's really pretty. But I think I'm gonna go with the purple one because that one looks so cute. And now here's where I get to use the hair. So there's a whole bunch of different hairstyles and you can actually just pinch it to shrink it. Uh, no, I don't think that looks like Aspen today. Well, um, <laughs> a little bit of pink for Aspen. Cute, I think I might go with this one, but let me see the last one. Mm, I don't know. Oh. Whoops, I shrank it a little bit too small. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with the colored one. That one looked really pretty. I just love the pink on this one. And that's Aspen. And guys, leave a comment down below. Do you like her with her app hair or her natural hair? I think I like her with her natural hair. It looks really pretty because it's way longer.
showed you guys today. I had so much fun snapping some awesome pictures in the app. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Little monkey fans, do you remember which one of the Snapstar dolls was my personality twin? If you know, leave a comment down below. Bye guys, see you next time. Thanks for watching. To join all the fun up in our tree top, please subscribe to Little Monkey Media's channel. Don't forget, if you like our video, please share it and click like. We go bananas for toys!